All right, Canes 4 TV. We're here with Dylan Beal, who was one of the first arrivals for Junior Day. So kudos to you. Um, Thank came you. down from Georgia, so uh, flew down at least. Didn't have to drive all those hours. Yeah. No. So, um, so Dylan, your class of 2026. Why did you want to come take this visit? Um, well, I picked up an offer from Coach Maribel on Tuesday at my high school, and so I decided, um, you know, why not come down to the U this weekend? Uh, right after picking up the offer, the offer earlier this week. Um, Playing for Miami has always been a dream of mine, or uh, having the chance to. Um, I watched the U documentary when I was a, was a kid, so Miami is just like a rich football culture, and having the chance to even come here is a complete honor and absolute privilege. Look at you walk in, I was saying to you, you know, class of 2026, you look like you should be a, a college senior already. So uh, where do you sort of stand in your recruiting process, offer-wise, school-wise, like what schools are you looking at a lot? Um, so right now I currently hold four offers. Um, three P5 offers um, from Indiana, Duke, USF, and Miami. Um, and I can't see a world where Miami's not a top five school long-term. So, you know, you're here from out of state. What is it specifically about Miami that you like? I obviously, met Coach Mirabal. Do you know much about the history of the program or is that what today's about, learning more about it? Uh, I, I, I feel like I'm pretty well versed in the history of the program since I'm a big college football fan. But I think I really want to come down and experience the campus, see what the school has to offer and kind of the surrounding area. And so far, I'm very impressed. What was Coach Maribel's message to you? I, you know, when you spoke to him, what was he saying about how sort of they envision you as a player? Why, you know, why Miami might be a good fit for you? Um, he said that he just uh, he really likes my film, and that's something that's a huge compliment to anybody. Uh, he said my explosion, my aggressiveness, my, like all that, and that's the best compliment you can get as an offensive lineman to have people compliment your film. What would be the earliest you want to make a decision? You obviously have so much time left in high school, but some guys do it super early. Some guys wait till signing day their senior year. What's your sort of thoughts? Uh, my goal is to be enjoy my senior year of playing high school football. So I want to be done with my recruiting process uh, by the time I'm a junior. Like probably after my junior season would be my ideal goal. What's most important to you as you go through this process? You're looking at all these different schools. What do you want? Like what what is what are those check marks uh, in the boxes that every school has to have for you? Uh, academics is my priority because playing in the NFL is my backup plan, right? So. You got obviously have to be prepared for injury and like the future after football. That's the most important thing. Uh, and then also to like cl climate, weather, like where I can see myself living, because there's a lot of schools where are, are great football schools, great programs, but I can't see myself living there necessarily. And Miami is a place I can see myself living and enjoying college. And last thing, when you got that Miami offer, was it out of the blue? Was it a shock? What was your reaction? Um, it wasn't necessarily a shock because uh, obviously it was a huge honor and compliment. But uh, Coach Mary Bell had let uh, our coach Beach know um, that he was coming to campus. And normally when offensive line coach comes to see an offensive lineman, you feel there's definitely a, a possibility um, that you'll pick up an offer. And it was just, it was just, it was definitely surreal because it's a dream of mine to play for Miami. We'll have a chance to play for Miami. And uh, it was just really cool. It was awesome. And I lied. It wasn't my last question. Do you have a number one choice right now? Is there like a top school or just keep things sort of wide open? Uh, like I said, I can't see a world where Miami's down in my top three. So, got it. So, no number one, but it's Miami's a, in the top three. Yes, sir. Awesome. Yes, sir. Thank you. Have a great yeah. trip. Thank you. Appreciate it.